Yo guys, it's Syro, you already know that today we're playing Super Monkey Ball 2. Uh, we are playing the story mode. Uh, it's actually in the main game here. And we are playing, yes, like I said, the story mode, um, which is really great. Uh, Super Monkey Ball 2 is has a really good story mode. Um, it's a lot of fun. And we are just going to get into it. Uh, obviously, I tried playing the first Super Monkey Ball game. Uh, it did not go great um, because you only have the challenge modes. And challenge modes exist in this game, but in the story mode, um, it gives you 10 stages that you can complete in any order, and you just have to beat it once, and then you can continue on. So, the fact that I'm not going to have to replay earlier stages to work back up, you know, there's no game overs or anything like that. Um, it's just, a level shows up, you beat the level, you move on. It's literally that simple. So, we're going to go ahead and just hop into the story mode. Hopefully you guys are excited about this, or as excited as I am about this. Um, if so, let me know. And let's go ahead and just uh, hop right into it. So, we're starting brand new. Um, I forgot, I guess there's more options that I uh, would have to pick. Uh, I'll just go with Sly because putting in more letters is so much effort. And nobody wants that. Everybody knows that I dislike effort. So let's go ahead and see what the story mode is all about. Uh-oh, what's this? <laughs> Looks like there are indeed more than four monkeys in this game, believe it or not. Oh, who's that? Haha! -ha! Bananas on this island are all for me! The great scientist, Dr. Bad Boon! People of the, the jungle island, if you hate me, you will starve! Hee <laughs> hee! Did he give himself that name or is that what he was born with? Because if you're born with the name Bad Boon, I mean, you're probably likely to turn out pretty evil. But it could just be his, uh, his villain name. Oh, hey, it's the heroes of the story. Stop it, Dr. Bad Boon. Everyone is going to hate you. Even more. Oh, everybody already hates him. Shut up. Shut up, you insolent monkey. If you want the bananas, you'll need to come to me. I will put all the bananas in my labyrinth. You'll need to survive my devious mazes to get them back. However... Do you think you'll make it out alive? I'll let him do the laugh. I can't do that. I'm not a villain, but he is, clearly. Ooh, Dr. Baboon, you won't get away with this. And with the power of friendship, we are going to go retrieve the bananas, uh, we're going to get them all, and it's going to be super fantastic. Uh, yeah, that's it. Dr. Baboon has stolen all the bananas. We need to go into these, collect the bananas. We don't even have to collect the bananas, we just need to make it to the goal. And uh, we're going to get going. So let's just start with the most simple one. I like how it has a little uh, difficulty um, rating based on the, the bananas from 1 to 10. I really like that. So we're just going to start with the first one, simple. Uh, does it actually just have, like, yeah, yeah, this is 1-1, one, one. so maybe we'll try and go in order, but we don't have to. We can go in any order we want. Alright, but this one is really simple, uh, and yeah, this should go really smoothly. I mean, do we try to get the bananas? Sure, why not? Is there... I guess we get a higher score for the bananas? I'm not actually sure what incentive there is to, uh, get the bananas, but hey, why not? We'll get them. We'll go into the goal. Hooray! And look at that, we're already off to a great start. We should be able to blast through the first couple worlds without too much issue. Um, after that, I have no idea. Um, and it looks like it's just going to be auto-saving the whole time, so... <laughs> Hopefully nothing messes up uh, on my end. Um, let's go ahead on to Hollow. I assume this is 1-2. Oh, hey, and... Oh, this is the one where you have to go around. Uh, I, can't, I don't really want to go for that stack of bananas, honestly. I would rather just take the long way around, the safe way. Uh, I know there is a way to do that, you just have to go really fast and all that sort of thing, but hey, it's fine. Uh, yeah, that's the one from the start. We can get these single bananas around the side here. It's kind of the same thing as the first uh, state. Alright, going for the bananas is a trap. You know what? That's what I get for not going after the big bunch of bananas. Try and give ourselves a little bit of momentum going up against the walls. 
Oh, I missed the banana. Well, I at least got to look cool missing the bananas and taking the shortcut. All right, I'll go after these bananas again. Again, I don't know what incentive there is to get these bananas, but hey, we're going for it. I guess we just really want that high score, even though we didn't get the big bunch of bananas, whatever. You think I care? I don't care. We're just gonna make our way through the game and uh, yeah, do all that sort of thing. Bumpy. Sure, why not? I actually remember this one being pretty simple. I think you can just hold forward, can't you? You might be able to just hold forward on this one. Uh, you have to come backwards if you want to get this big bunch of bananas, but again, I'm not that worried about getting the uh, the big bunches. I, I, I stopped holding forward so I could slow down a little bit. Uh, this is, we're just going to speed run through the first world, no problem. Alright, what's the next level? Switches! This one's also pretty simple. Simple. Ugh. I mean, everything... Uh, everything here in the first world should be really easy. Because it is basically just like... Um, an introduction to the game for people who have never played it. And they want to, you... They want to familiarize you with the concept of like what this game is. How to beat the mazes. All that sort of stuff. So... Hey, hey! Uh, one more and we're already halfway through. Like I said, there's ten stages on every world. Uh, we just need to beat them. And then we move on to the next world. Ooh, that, that one's so much harder. I'm sure it's not actually that hard. I don't believe it. I think the game's lying. And I like this game, uh, as opposed to the first game. Uh, they actually started giving the stages little, uh, names. Oh. Oh, I see. What, you actually need speed to get through? I was just trying to get the bananas and stuff. Oh, and that slows you down. Whoa! Alright, we just go at full speed. We shouldn't have any issues. I don't care about the rest of the bananas. Whoa! Wait, wait, wait. Can you actually get the speed? You probably just can't hit any uh, other conveyors. Oh! Oh! Maybe I should have just held forward from the start. Oh! I don't know how to get the straightaway speed. I should have just held straight from the beginning. Oh, right down the middle. That's how. Simple as that. I guess that one was hard, um, by comparison to the other stages on the first world, but uh, it's not actually that difficult. Photos is another one that, uh, it's pretty simple. You can try to get on the platforms to get extra bananas if you want, um, or you can just go right to the goal, um, by going around this and just being on the flat ground. It's, it's pretty simple. Here, we'll get one bunch of bananas just to, I don't know, m make me feel happy. Because bananas are my only, uh, sort of, uh, whatever thing that makes me happy. If I don't have bananas, I don't have anything. That's pretty much all there is to it. And slow- oh, okay. Oh, wait, this one's actually kind of fun. I think. So, one of my favorite things to do is to, um beat stages in a, in like the not intended way, like to find a shortcut or to find a, a different way to do it. And I think if you get enough speed, I think there's a way that you could ramp off one of these up directly to the goal. Come on, let's go! Oh, oh I made it up there, but I got denied by the ball. Alright, we'll pretend like that was successful because I basically got what I was going for. So you guys know what I was doing. I hope you're very impressed. I'm very impressed with myself. Alright, look at that, we're speeding through World 1. Sliders, this should be simple. This one, I know you have to pace yourself a little bit, uh, because you can start going too fast and fly off the side. I also think there's a way to skip past some. Hold up, can I skip past some of this level? Oh, I didn't, that's not the angle. There's a way you can go off the edge here and end up on, like, the next one and skip a, a portion of the stage. I was trying to see if I could do it, but I didn't have the angle there. I've seen people uh, use these walls to kind of gain momentum and speed. I, I think it works. Mm, no, I don't have I don't have the angle. I can't get the angle on that one. Maybe you can't do it on the first turn. Maybe you can do it on these turns. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna bother trying. I don't think the reward of, of getting a, a shortcut on the stage is, is worth it as uh, as much as on other stages. We're definitely gonna mess around with trying to get fun ways to complete other stages, but uh, this one's 
This one's not it. Hold straight. Always go fast. Much speed, very fast. And we are off to... Ooh, spinning top. Hey, this one's actually kind of difficult. Because you can get hit by a top and uh, flung the whole way across the world. But we shouldn't have an issue as long as we're smart. Uh, which, as we know, I'm very smart, of course. Nothing bad will ever <laughs> happen. <laughs> like me just going off the edge for no reason there. Good thing that wasn't the edge of the world. Alright. Uh, I did that on purpose, uh, surely, to, to reset the top. Let's see. So it's there. I'd rather just go around to the right, I think. Wait, is there room for me to not get by the top? Oh. Alright, that was easier than I made it out to be. I thought it extended to, like, the edge of the, the platform up here, but it didn't. And we've only got one more world to go. Uh, easy. Curve bridge. Oh, simple. I'm pretty sure uh, the the platform there is a lot more wider than the preview would have you believe. And you have 60 seconds, not 30, so we have plenty of time to make it. Yeah, look at that. We have all this room. Like, we're not falling off. We have to be slightly careful. Boy, I'm not really that worried. Who's worried? As I just realized, I don't think I got to pick my character. I just have to be I.I., I., which is so boring. I.I. is such a boring uh, protagonist. So much worse than any of the other three options that you can be. Ooh. And then we have to... I know this one moves. If you get on now, it will uh, pour us into the waterfall, which we don't want. Uh, and I'm pretty sure if we go up, it'll have us go back a little bit. Either way, you just got to be careful. Take it easy. Go into the goal. And we've already finished wor World 1. How about that? We are cruising through this game at mock speed. And it's time for more story. Let's go. And everyone is doing their best to survive. We've got to help get all the bananas back. Then we have to stop Dr. Baboon before he causes more trouble. But where is he now? Uh, maybe in that massive blimp that is charging towards you. Oh, my sweet Mimi. I'm here for you. If you marry me, I'll give back all the bananas. Mmm, what a conundrum. Marry you! Ew! I would rather starve to death than marry you! Oh, your words hurt me. But is it your fault? You must be influenced by this village. My sweet Mimi, I don't think you should live here anymore. I will sink this island. Then, my dear, you'll see how strong I am. If you won't love me, then learn to despise me. Alright, what a master plan. That's a pretty rough way to deal with rejection, bro. I think you uh, need to find a healthier coping mechanism, personally. But, oh no, what have I done? I mean, you don't owe him anything. No, he's really gone mad. I'll never let him... Uh, sick this island. I don't know why all the music like went away. <laughs> I guess I was supposed to be a really uh, passionate speech. Oh, right, we're going right into the volcano. I didn't realize this was second world. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, what a beautiful volcano. I'll just put this super dynamite time bomb right here. When this bomb blows up, the volcano will erupt. Almost bars. Poor Jungle Island is going to sink into the sea. Ha 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 ha! You will be able to laugh. Insert whatever. Yes. So he's just going to blow up a volcano, and I guess it's going to make it erupt? And then it's going to sink the island? And this is Dr. Baboon's airship. He must be here. Also, we can, like, fly in our monkey balls. I'm really waiting for someone who um, is not super familiar with this game to just show up in chat while one of those cutscenes is going off, um, because I think that would just be hilarious, but it hasn't happened yet. I'm waiting for it, though. 